Hi! I bet you're wondering why I'm wearing a hat today. It's not just an ordinary hat. This is my scientist hat. You know why I'm wearing this today? Because we're going to be thinking like scientists. Do you have a scientist hat? You do? Go and get it. So this is called a magnet. The paper clips were attracted to the magnet. Magnets are made up of metal, steel, and iron. Some things are attracted to magnets and some things aren't. So before I started my science experiment, I had to gather all my material that I needed. So hopefully mom and dad have a magnet at home. And then I went around the house and found objects that I wanted to experiment with to see if they were magnetic, or non-magnetic. Okay, so do you have your scientist hat on? Are you ready? Okay, so I found a pizza cutter. The top part's metal, the bottom half is plastic. We're going to see if it's magnetic or non-magnetic. Do you think it's going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? I'm going to test the top part of it with this metal. Let's see. It is. It's magnetic. My next object is a quarter. Do you think that this, this is going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. It's non-magnetic. Here's a salt shaker. The bottom part is glass. The top is made out of metal. So I wanted to see if this metal would attract to the magnet. Let's see if it's magnetic or non-magnetic. Let's see. It's magnetic. My next object is a stapler. Some of it there's plastic on some, but there's also metal. So we're going to test the, um, the metal. Do you think it's going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. It's magnetic. This is a shell. Do you think the shell is going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? You do? Non-magnetic? Let's see. You're right, it was non-magnetic. Here's a container of Play-Doh. Do you think it's going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? You were right, it's non-magnetic. The container is made out of plastic. Here's a tablespoon. Do you think it's going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. It it's magnetic. This is a metal lid that I found. Do you think this metal lid is going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. It's non-magnetic. I wonder why this metal lid is non-magnetic. Hmm. That's something to research. Here is a screwdriver. Okay. The bottom part is plastic, the handle. The top part of the Phillips screwdriver is metal. Do you think it's going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. It's magnetic. This is a domino. It's made out of ceramic. Do you think it's going to be Magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. Non-magnetic. And I have one more thing. I have a marble coaster. Do you think this is going to be magnetic or non-magnetic? Let's see. You were right. It's non-magnetic. So, now, what we'd like you to do is go around your house, and first thing you have to do is ask mom and dad if they have a magnet. And then you're going to find things that you want to experiment with 
to see if they're magnetic or non-magnetic. And when you're done, you can make your own list of magnetic and non-magnetic. So you can also draw pictures like I did too. So I wrote words and then I also drew some pictures for my magnetic and non-magnetic objects. So we hope that you had a fun time being a scientist today. Have a great day and we can't wait to see your videos and photographs of you being a scientist at home. Have a great day. Bye.